What's up, YouTube? Top City 5401 here, and this is video number 36 on my road to 5,000. I do have three pickups to show off. I'm at a total of 4,971 unique Barry Bonds cards in my collection now. And I'm showing you guys my 1998 Topps Techs as well as my 99 and 2000s, just so you could learn a little bit about them. And I did pick up a card for the Tech Collection. These cards are sweet. The 98s, there are 90 patterns for each player. So as you can see, the background is different on all the cards. The cards are acetate and they have a refractor finish to them. These cards are spectacular. They're great for any player collector that had a player that they collect in 1998. I have about 55 or 60 of the 98 patterns. And then in 1999 Topps Tech, there were two photo variations with 50, or, uh, 30 patterns per. So a total of 60 different 99 Topps Tech cards for each player. And this is the one I picked up for my Bonds collection. So there we go. I'll show you the rest of my 1998 or 1999 Topps Tech cards. And I have over half the 99s as well. I think I have about 40 of the different variations. And then in 2000, it got a little bit easier to chase them all down. They had three different photo variations and five patterns per photo. So there were 15 of the basic texts, and then there were five short prints, which are not in this binder. So comment down below, guys. Let me know what you think about the tech cards. And I'm going to move along here with some of my other pickups for the Bonds PC, Chase to 5000. So my second pickup is this 2003 Donruss Diamond Kings, and this is a season stat line. This one is the RBI stat line. And what Donruss did with some of their uh, parallels is they would pick a stat that a player had from either a career stat or a season stat. And then they use that stat to determine the print run. So Bonds had 110 RBIs in 2002. And so this one is a season stat line, RBIs, so there are 110 copies. So that is my new pickup for the stat line. Also want to show you another one. So they didn't just do one stat line. They do like a few. This one is um, batting average for 2002. So his batting average is 295. So they printed 295 of the non-shiny version. That's also a cool stat line. And of course, those are the base and uh, one, another parallel right there of that same card. And one more pickup to show off, guys. All right, so the third pickup is this 1998 Upper Deck Choice Star Quest. This is the foil one. This is the one with the three stars at the bottom, really tough to find. Has a foil stock compared to the regular card with the paper stock. So really thrilled to add that one to the collection. So guys, 4,971 and counting, 29 to go. Comment down below, let me know what you think. And as always, happy collecting.